Yo, what is good, you guys? It's Jay Roach back in another video, and I'm um, sorry for my hiatus. It's been really bad. But um, this video, I'm about to show you guys how to basically create your own samples. Like, I'm about to make, this one probably might be in my loot pack, but maybe not. My loot pack is dropping next week. I don't even know what it's called. Um, I just had to force myself to drop it because I have lots of loot that I want to give y'all. I'm giving away my loot kit to five people at 500 subscribers. Um, so, let's do it. Yeah, make sure you guys like, comment, subscribe, um, hit the little notification bell, and let's just get into the video. Okay, so right now I'm going to pull up just like a pretty simple, uh, kind of unusable guitar, but I'm gonna try to make it usable, um, kind of make it fine. So let's try to pick like a little nylon guitar from Citrus. Right now we have this nylon guitar. Uh, let's just try like, I like the natural aeolian scale, but I also like D. Whoa! Sharp. Uh, that's a good scale for me. I don't know why, but I always just gravitate towards it. Okay. So let's just put uh, let's put down a melody and let's see what happens. All right, so like what I like to do for most, like if I'm making like a sample or a loop for somebody, uh, is make it like three full bars. <coughs> Jeez. So like three full bars. Yeah, like literally just like this. All right, yeah, so we have this little 12 bar, three bar, whatever you want to say, thing. Um, and here's the MIDI. I'm gonna save it real quick. Uh... All right, so what I'm gonna do right now is I'm gonna Alt A, I'm gonna Alt R it, randomize the velocities. Uh, I'm gonna randomize uh, some of the, yeah, I'm gonna randomize some of the levels like that. Um, like panning uh, a little bit, so it's kind of cool. All right, so we're gonna Alt S, yeah, there we go. Uh, switch the direction of the chords, just, I mean, you can do that if you want. I'm gonna see what that does. Just kind of play around with the knobs, you know what I mean? Here's what it sounds like. So now, next, 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 next. What you want to do, throw this guy in the mixer. Boom, and you're gonna add, what I like to do is add some reverb to it, off jump, uh, make it pretty big. I'm gonna add a little bit of delay to it. I'm just gonna play around with these knobs, honestly. And then I'm gonna add a little isotope vinyl to give it a little sample-y feel, you know what I mean? So this is a free plugin, so you can add like scratch. It's gonna OD like that. You know what I mean? You can add like scratches and stuff. So I'm gonna add like a couple scratches. Subtle. You can add like dust. Like, you know, like in the background. You know what I mean? That's dust, yeah. You know what I'm saying? Just play around with it. So I'm just gonna play around with it. Right, all right, boom. And we are going to actually, let's put a chorus on it maybe. I don't know, you know what I'm saying? It might be fine. Do some random. Okay, so now what we're gonna do since it's like pretty simple. Uh, I'm gonna EQ the low end. Just a little bit. All right, what we're gonna do is we're gonna render this to a WAV file. So what I did was I pushed this uh, this little recording button and then I hit Alt R and I rendered the pattern. This whole pattern. And now what we're gonna do is let's put some more effects on it. Let's uh, put some, uh... 
This happens every video that I've done this week. That's why I haven't posted a video. So we rendered it back to a wave. Let's save this, honestly. And then uh, I want to put some, like, let's like, let's put some like gross beat on it. Okay. I don't know. Like, honestly, guys, it's like you can do whatever you want. I'm just like, honestly, just having fun with it. So I'm going to put the time knob down. Yeah, so you just like kind of get really creative with it. Uh, so then, um, what next I would do is I would re I would record this, you know, into a wave. So let's record this real quick. I know this is getting into a long video, but uh, this is just stuff you can do. So there it is. All right. So next, what I would want to do, maybe. Let's uh, go to Fruity Slicer. Also, what I would what I do sometimes too is. You can also reverse some of these. So like beat 13, let's reverse it. Wherever that, I don't know what beat. Yeah, so now it's reversed. So it's kind of fire. So, you know, just play around with it. Let's just play around with it, hit a melody, honestly. I'm just gonna record some. Let's record some. See what happens. So I probably wouldn't do anything like that, but maybe just keep it like this. But you can definitely chop it up, do what you want to it. So this is definitely a fire sample. I hope you guys enjoyed and learned something. Did it with a pretty unusable instrument, so you guys can do it with anything, bro. Yeah, let me know what you guys want to see next in the comments. Uh, like, comment, subscribe, and peace.